gonna, I'm gonna just start off by saying, making friends is already hard, but making friends when you have a disability is even harder. I'm gonna tell you guys some tips how to make new friends with a disability or cerebral palsy if you wanna make it like that. But taking the time and going out to like talk to people is one of the things that you may wanna do or want to do because. If you don't reach out to people, they'll only see you as little or you just don't want to be bothered. And I've learned that in the past because people would look at me like, oh, she's just that quiet girl sitting in the corner that doesn't want to be bothered. So that's what I think you should do first and foremost. This is the most important thing, I think. Before someone questions your disability, I like what I like to do is I like to tell them because for me I don't like when people point it out like in an obvious way. I like it when they ask questions but like say, oh you you walk like that. No kidding, I walk like that, yes. But um I just like to state the facts saying, oh yes, I have a disability, this is what it is, blah, blah, blah. And what's your name, what's your favorite color? Getting to know each other. And that's the most, that's the most important thing I have to say is just go right off the bat. Tell them what's wrong. And if you don't feel comfortable with that, then don't do it. By all means, don't do it. Like, I'm not forcing you to do it. I'm just saying this is a tip that will help you get some friends. Oh god, that made it seem like you don't have any friends. I'm sorry. If they don't want to talk to you, don't force it on them. I've learned that in the past because it just makes it even stressful and not worth it. Not worth it. It's not worth your time, really. It's really not. So, don't even worry about that. Ask them questions about their self is also good. Just don't let them pressure you into having you answer all the questions about yourself. Let them answer some questions that you want to ask them. Because that's how you make the two-way connection in a relationship between two people. So that's one of the important things, pieces to it too. If they just judge you for what you look like and they don't actually get to know you, it's very cruel. And I want to say just ignore it, but ignoring it is not good. Tell them about yourself. Maybe they'll understand once you tell them about yourself. Maybe. Friends are friends and they love you, they love you to death and all that stuff and yeah. Please leave a comment down below as to what videos you would like me, you would like to see me do relating to cerebral palsy. Because, please, I'm begging you, please, I want to answer any of your questions in a video, or maybe I can do a video response. Like this video for me to do a video response. And if you do, you can message me and I will do a video response, or maybe a live stream in the future. So, yeah. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not up to if you're not subscribed already, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye!